May the peace of the Lord be with you all. As we bring to you the readings of today's Holy Mass, let us now listen to the Word of God. A reading from the book of Jonah. The word of the Lord came to Jonah a second time, saying, Get up, go to Nineveh, that great city, and proclaim to it the message that I tell you. So Jonah set out and went to Nineveh, according to the word of the Lord. Now Nineveh was an exceedingly large city, a three days walk across. Jonah began to go into the city, going a day's walk. And he cried out, Forty days more, and Nineveh shall be overthrown. And the people of Nineveh believed God, they proclaimed a fast, and everyone, great and small, put on sackcloth. When God saw what they did, how they turned from their evil ways, God changed his mind about the calamity that he had said he would bring upon them, and he did not do it. The Word of the Lord A reading from the first letter of St. Paul to Corinthians. I mean, brothers and sisters, the appointed time has grown short. From now on, let even those who have wives be, as though they had none, and those who mourn, as though they were not mourning, and those who rejoice, as though they were not rejoicing, and those who buy, as though they had no possessions, and those who deal with the world, as though they had no dealings with it. For, the present form of this world is passing away. The Word of the Lord Sing hallelujah to the Lord, hallelujah. Sing hallelujah to the Lord, hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lord. A reading from the Holy Gospel, according to Mark. Now after John was arrested, Jesus came to Galilee, proclaiming the good news of God, and saying, The time is fulfilled, and the kingdom of God has come near. Repent, and believe in the good news. As Jesus passed along the Sea of Galilee, he saw Simon and his brother Andrew casting a net into the sea, for they were fishermen. And Jesus said to them, Follow me and I will make you fish for people. And immediately they left their nets and followed him. As he went a little farther, he saw James son of Zebedee and his brother John, who were in their boat mending the nets. Immediately he called them, and they left their father Zebedee in the boat with the hired men, and followed him. The Gospel of the Lord Thank you for listening to the readings and gospel. May God bless us all.